Look at him go! <laughs> I'm in Mario Kart right now. What? No, my died! It died! <laughs> hey, when the squad rolls up. <laughs> <Dude>. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Dope or Nope, guys. The channel where we every time the Wait. channel where we Wait. rate product dope or nope, or we spend spill water all over. I Canada. figured out why he stutters. He'll be going great, and then he'll look left for confirmation, and he'll stutter every time. Because he's looking left for me. Yeah, Camera. he looked left. He's like the channel where we rate. Like he did it like we four times. Water. <laughs> Today, guys, we are checking out ten amazing kids' toys that adults use for themselves. Product one: their hands. <laughs> he followed <laughs> through. Respect. Here at Dope Now, guys, we believe we can find the absurdity in just about anything. So be sure to grab a friend, grab your dog, your mom, your sister, whomever it might be, and let's get into product number one. All right, guys. So this product is from Mega Moto. Introducing our new Mega Max 212 CC mini bike Dude, that's with awesome. front suspension. You can get it with credit. Sixty-six dollars a month with credit. Can you imagine putting a loan on this? <laughs> on this? I gotta get this, guys. Gotta put a loan. Gotta put a down payment. Gotta get a Mega Moto. Dude, look how like, Look at those fatty tires. Girthy mm. this thing is. 29 miles per hour max speed. That is enough to terrify you. And it's gas powered, so it's just like Yeah, yeah, loud too. Fun fact guys, this product was actually sent to us by Megamoto. Thank you guys for sending this product. Let's test this baby out. Add the cart! Check us out. Dibs, got it. Second dibs. I have second. <laughs> you I'll let anything. him go first. This is my oh. product. No, it's not. It's our product. Whose head is this supposed to fit? You gotta, you gotta, yeah. You ever mow a lawn or what? No, because yeah. I'm Mexican. No? No, I <laughs> I was like, oh no, he got me! Cause I, I, uh... That's tight. This looks like the Dark Knight bicycle mixed with Captain America's bicycle, you know? He looks like Yo, Batman, that's sick. bro. Look at him go! I feel like I'm watching NASCAR. Yo, this is lit. This is, this is like watching a drag race. And it looks good and it sounds wholesome. You can tell he's enjoying it too, because he's going for a couple laps. He's having a good time with it. Okay, so that's awesome. One of the unique characteristics of a bike like this is the thick, fat tires. Kind of the thing that it really changes is the ride is really smooth. And the second thing is it's really kind of awkward to turn. I'm sure you can get really used to it. However, leaning just doesn't really happen. You really got to lean into it, you know? Ah! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I thought he hit Connor's car. He gave it way too much he gas. Went, <laughs> and he just went right into Connor's I car. I thought I almost lost my life. I wasn't expecting it to have that much give right away. You like took off so successful. It was just like a gradual. Oh yeah. I just sent it and I was like, woo! <laughs> Here we go, baby. But yeah, definitely when you're riding, you do have to like lean way more into it to make the tires go with your body to whichever way you want to turn. I'm gonna say that's a pretty sick dope. Yeah, for that's sure. a hardcore dope. High key that's dope. A dope. Capture the flag redux. What does redux mean? It means pretty much like redo. Brought back. Revive. You guys don't trust me now. Well, it's not redo. It's brought back. Cross into enemy territory to try to steal the other team's flag and return it to your side of the field. So it's pretty much capture the ball. You divide the field, suit up, hide the orb, and then capture the flag. You can tell they were all like just not actually in motion when they took this photo. Yeah, probably. Look at that guy in the back right. That dude is not walking. <laughs> He's not even moving at all. He's just like taking like, a picture about... already. <laughs> okay, add the cart. Oh, cool packaging. Oh, you can have a lot of different players. Wait, what is there, some playing cards here? I guess those are for uh, possible ways to set up the map or something. This one's called the president. Sometimes the target isn't a place, it's a person. Set up the game for capture the flag, but rather than hiding the orb, each team chooses a president. Player must carry the orb at all times and cannot hide it or pass it off. Well, I really like this idea a lot. Like these cards here that have like all different these games. different game modes, like that's hours of fun. So you wanna go play downstairs yeah, in dude. the warehouse? You wanna go play? <laughs> So you wanna go play? <laughs> All right guys, what's up? We're in Red Base Warehouse right now and we're gonna be capturing the flag, but we brought along Paul from GG, we brought along Connor from GG, and we have CJ here from Battle Universe. So pretty much we said, let's set up a little trial. It's uh, the Dope Nope guys versus GG. Oh, you're part of GG too. So Dope Nope versus GG today. All right, so we're gonna be divided into two teams. Each team will have their respective side, right? Each team will have their own orb. Orange gets blue, we get green. You're gonna take your orb and you're gonna hide it. The opposite team has to go and find your orb, but if they find your orb, they get the point and they win. If they don't find it and you find theirs first, First, you gotta bring it win. back though, right? However, if you get tagged in the process of it, you have to go to jail. So we've sectioned off some little side corners and that's where you're gonna go to jail. So first to get it, you win. So we'll leave first, you guys can hide your orb first and then we'll come back, you guys. Hide it? Yeah, you gotta hide it. Hear me out. We just bury it in the Legos. That's the obvious thing to do. 
Okay, so we just put it under that cone right there. This is the play. This is the play. This is what we're doing. You guys good? Hey, 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 hey. There's no way. The there's no way. You good? Yeah, we're good. Wait, they have a lot to place we to hide there. We have so there. much <laughs> to hide. No, easy. Watch this. Let's put it somewhere super obvious. Let's put it underneath one of the cones. Wait, how tall are they? Maybe we can just put it higher than... <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. I knew it was in the cones. I literally walked in and knew it. There we go. Okay. Pump All right, we're ready. All right, first I want to address the fact that we heard everything you said and the fact that you found our thing already. All right, let's do this. All right, let's do it. I thought I just played defense. <laughs> <laughs> no. You're on my side. I just tagged you. I just tagged him. Oh, yeah, you got to tag I got him. Oh. <laughs> he walked on my side. Your knees. <laughs> Put your knees on my side. I'm watching you, boy. Yeah, this well, thing. DJ, just sprint over there. If you touch me, you have to take me. You're in jail. <laughs> okay, he's got to take me. <laughs> <laughs> it's every day, bro, on the Disney Channel. <laughs> <laughs> Green shirts win. And that was us. And I rate this product. A uh, dough. If dope. there's more space and there's more places to hide it too, it would be wild. Next product. Uh, hey everybody, uh, this next product is a like to buy. It is the Mechamon Berserker V2 gaming robot. I'm talking like this because my friends say uh, my voice is... Uh, so pretty much what we want to do here is we want to get two of these robots as I descend back into my normal voice. We want to get two of these robots and we want to have a giant battle with them. <gasps> we think it's going to be dumb lit. And I claim right now that the loser has to admit to the other one that they are inferior, just in general, in life. I'll just admit that right now. I'm inferior. To who? You. All right, well, this like to buy is all over with. <laughs> I just wanted you to hear that because you know I'm going to win. <laughs> <laughs> Let's watch the video. This will better explain to you guys what it does. It's dancing, dude. Serious. R. A R. <laughs> okay, they just look like they're spiders in heat. <laughs> right? They're just like dancing at each other. <laughs> they're doing the mating dance. Are they gonna actually do and something? the music? <laughs> it's like, whoa! Oh. That one was Michael Talamantaz. Okay, so they didn't even show fighting. I'm upset. Anyone else upset? Just me? Cool. All right, guys. So in order for us to buy two of these robots and then have them duel, we're gonna be asking for 110,000 likes. He went with 10. Okay? And I want you guys to comment down below, battle bots, to let us know you guys wanna see it. Because if you guys get a ton of those comments, with battle balls down below, you might be like, hey, we might do something crazy, you know? Yeah, what he said. But translate it to English. Yeah, please. <laughs> uh, on to the next product. We're back with Mega Moto. And this time they sent us not just one. How many, Michael? But two. What? That's more than one. Go karts. They sent us two go karts? Two go karts. Two full gas powered go karts. Wow. I'm tripping. Excited. These ones don't go as fast as the motorcycle we reviewed earlier. These ones only go 18 miles per hour. The motorcycle, I think, went 29 or 30. Still, that's fast. Try to take a turn at 20 miles an hour in one of these things. You're like top <laughs> Just over. rolled over. Yeah. All right, let's add the cart in. Let's go in the back of Red Base. All right, guys, so we're back at it with Mega Moto. This time we got. <laughs> Dude, check out these go karts. It's Waluigi versus Mario. Give them a Mario. little bit of whirl, a little 360, Liz. Hi, Liz. These are pretty dumb cool. You know what I'm saying? Honestly, I'm super tall. And, like, you ever played Mario Kart? I look like Waluigi Is right now. Is that just a random flex? Honestly, I'm super tall. You ever played Mario Kart? <laughs> no, because Waluigi's super tall. I'm super tall. I'm in Mario Kart right now. All right, wait here, how about this, ready? Let's have you both split, you go right, you go left, and see who gets here back the fastest. I don't want to get wrecked. I don't want to get hit. <laughs> yeah, just be careful. Just okay. be safe, I'll time it. All right, so we're gonna have Tan Man go to the right, we're gonna have Matthias go to the left, and they're gonna circle around our entire building, and then whoever gets here first, we'll see who's the fastest at it. Three, two, one, go! I'm so fast! And just like that, they grow up so fast. All right, so by now, they probably should be like approaching the corner of the building, which is like where Blue Base is located. What? No, my died! It died! No! Oh, man. All right, Tanner, you can do this. I think by now, they should be somewhat coming around the corner. That's Matthias, guys. Woo! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, dude. A minute and 15. Yeah, I saw Tanner, and I saw he also stalled, so. Rookie, Rookie boy. Dude, I want one of these guys. I'm gonna go get him. All right. Bye. She won't start. Did I hit that? No. Come on, did you see that? <laughs> I tried to start it. I'm so mad. I found him. Oh wait, I think I hear him coming back. Wow, he did two laps and he just finished one. 
<laughs> hey, when the squad rolls up. <laughs> Dude, this thing is so tight. I hit the kill switch and Matt saw me hit the kill switch and I didn't know. So I was literally trying to start it and I could not figure out why. And he came through and was like, hit the kill switch, bro. And I was like, oh. uh, Did those feel like pretty secure and like durable? While you yeah, yeah. Out? They for sure feel durable. They're quick. There you go. You That's have a it. Dope. That's a dope. dope. That's a high dope. All right, next product. Mini PSP retro arcade built-in 64-bit 3000 classic games handheld console player. Look at all these games, dude. They got Dragon Ball Z. No. Yeah, they have all the anime to yeah, play. That is every anime. Then right they there. have the watermelon fight. These are all screenshots from the same game. This is what I'm curious <laughs> about. Are they, do they have actual games? Or are these just 3000 rip-off games? Look, yeah. that's Pikachu. No, it's Picocho. <laughs> <laughs> Bye now. Hey, would you look at that? Just look at it. <laughs> just look at it. Yeah. Would you look at that? <laughs> Now think about what you did. Dude, this looks like it's like clear. Yeah, it actually does. Dude, they are trying to mimic the PlayStation. Yeah, that's definitely the old PSP format. Oh, it's a fighting game. Oh, dude, we have to, we're working together. Oh, this is a co-op? Wait. Oh, I wanted to beat you up, dude. I'm the girl? Who's this guy? That's me. Oh. <laughs> Wait, which one's hey. trying to fight? Hey. <laughs> I'm trying to kick you. hi yeah. Yeah, the girl's way better than you. Not Watch out. Close. Where, where are the special moves? Oh, uh, you have to hit buttons. Wait, am I, where am I at? I keep getting hit. All right, I think we did it. Yeah, we definitely did it. And it still says Oh, wow, I just ninja kicked us through a window, brother. <laughs> So, I mean, this works pretty well. What is the setting for this game? Is it like Jurassic World? <laughs> That's what it feels like, dude. The, the, the dinos are just teaming up with the gangs. <laughs> They're just like, we're gonna take over the street. I'm dead. Where are we? I think I'm past, I just passed away. It looks like your luck just ran out. Thanks, yeah. grandma. Nice shoulder pass. You guys look like a grandma. <laughs> well, that wasn't bad. I could definitely see how you can lose some time to it because there's tons of video games. So I'll, I'll say that's a dope. Dude. I'll say that's a dope. Cool wheel. <laughs> <laughs> but I like that because it was like excited but relaxed. They got some cool wheels, man. They got some new designs. They got like hover shoes. They smart balancing. They got one wheel electric scooter. Uh, this product. Electric scooter. Electric scooter. <laughs> this product was sent to us by Cool Wheel themselves. There's some pretty cool guys over there and gals. This is like a skateboard but with one wheel. Let's see what these oh cool my God. that guy. I love this aesthetic. I feel like I'm about to watch a K pop music video. I'm about it. I'm here for it. Tanner, can you do that? Yeah, probably. Wow, that's really cool. Whoa. That made me nervous. I guess I'm just curious if it'll be as easy as just riding a regular hoverboard. Or if the responses will be different because now your feet are separate. Yeah, well, your legs can separate. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. It's like you're on two different playing fields now. Could be kind of hot. Elaborate. So, in order for... <laughs> Actually, I don't want it. <laughs> totally fine. Understandable. All right, bye now. Thank you, Chanel. Look at that. It's a beautiful. I love the hover shoes font. Looks like somebody stole it from a hay bale. Very tiny. These are for people with the feet the size of Michael. But I'm sure we can make this work. Oh, that's heavy. Yeah, it looks like it pretty much just works very similar to a hoverboard. It works extremely similar. <laughs> oh, it needs to be balanced for sure, though. <gasps> oh, almost broke my feet. Dude, it's doing it by itself. He's a rogue. Try to push down, try to push down on this. Oh, I tried pushing down on mine. Say goodbye to those donuts we had. Yo, you want this one? Yeah. Oh, shoot. I told him I was delivering, right? Uh, this is not balanced. What is it doing? This looks hard just to get on. <laughs> It just went out from under me. It just went, this is hard. Yeah, I hated that wall too. Those are dangerous. All right, we're gonna try them in the warehouse because that's where we'll be able to get an accurate gauging on how well they work in an open environment. And how fast they go. I'm scared. It's all you, my guy. I'll take one if you how want. How do you balance them? Just gonna set it to balance mode. This is gonna be whoa, a broken head. Oh, buddy. Dude, it's scared right now. It's like, bro, he's gonna step on me. What? Why did it just give up on me? Okay, see you later. <laughs> <laughs> I don't trust these. Out. That's legit me on the first day of school when I was a kid. <laughs> I don't understand how you balance it. It doesn't act like a hoverboard. I'm assuming when it turns green, that means it's going, but it's only green for just a split. Yeah, I know. Second, like, then it just goes red. I think it got balanced incorrectly. I'll try these. We got two for some reason now. This one's off balance. Oh wait, it balanced itself. So it was that set. <laughs> See what we said was true. If your legs go too far from each other, then you're in a split, bro. How's the groin feel? It's okay. <laughs> oh, I got in a position that was about to get bad and I, like, I bailed. Uh, like, I'm sorry, I give it a nope. There's no way, like, it's just not clear how to calibrate them. There's no instructions online either. It's a little sketch. All right, we got a toilet paper blaster skid shot. I think I call it a skid shot. <laughs> <laughs> Holy sheets, toilet paper blasters, fire toilet paper up to 30 feet. It's not even that far. 30 feet, that's 10 yards. Nerf blasters go 90 feet. Wait, so this is essentially creating like spit wads. Yeah. Yep, yep that's what it is. 
sense. That made more sense to me. I don't understand like what this company thinks. Who's gonna buy this? Because it's like kids might want it, but a parent's gonna be like, I don't want you to make a mess in my house. I mean, to be honest, I would buy this for my kid. And they're allowed to use it in the house? Mm, maybe like only outdoors. Oh, okay, so they're allowed to litter. It. Got it. And like the backyard, <laughs> like go use it in the backyard. Pick up your trash or use it in the backyard. Pick I wouldn't up your buy trash? this for my kid. Yeah. I'd buy this for me. Imagine me spitballing you on a daily basis. That's like a dream of mine. First thing in the morning, he's up there working on his computer, you know, focus as always, and I just come up, boom, spitball, centered his forehead. <laughs> There's no way to react to that. Yeah, there is. It's close the door, come in. <laughs> Add a cart! Dang Chanel. All right, so use this real toilet paper. Feeding mechanisms right here. You got the water tank, air chamber, trigger. Oh, oh yeah, where there tart? Ooh. It's leaking spit, just like your jowls. He's aiming that directly at me. I heard that's how you load those, is you just eight times. Eight? No, yeah, why know. are you doing it so many oh, times? Oh, you just said eight. Yeah, it's too many. Normally you only do one. Ew! <laughs> it's stuck. <laughs> I'm all about this. I just mean to try. Oh, it's pouring water everywhere. You guys are doing it wrong for sure. There's no way this can intake toilet paper. It's soap. Do you see that dust? <laughs> Where is the TP? Oh. <laughs> I just saw like the it white. It splattered the gook just... on me. Oh, it's yeah, all over so... me. Oh. oh. <laughs> that is disgusting. <laughs> Don't. Scream. Don't. Scream. No. Say you're imperial. <laughs> Dude, that was a good size one too. Come on, the kids wanted to see it. We're gonna use it, we gotta use it, right? <laughs> this is just cool. I'm sorry for everyone, but this is just fun to shoot. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I didn't no. shoot it at you. If you hit me in the face, it's over. <laughs> My head! I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> shit. You shot the barrel up? Did you shot the oh, I stuffed it way too full. <laughs> It ruined a horrible <laughs> mess. Entire mess. And I have toilet table. paper all over. That is literally the worst product oh, I've ever I seen. I hate that product. That is a mega no. If it leaked a little bit, it would maybe be fine. But no! That it leaked that much. As an adult, I don't want that. That's a dope for me. It's a nope from them too. You know. No, 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 no. I gave it a mega no. And I gave it a dope. So it brings it down to a nope. And that's two nopes make a rope. So. <laughs> Spike. Scooter. What is this? So it's a scooter meets bike. No, this is a scooter meets a unicycle. <laughs> okay. That's an awkward shot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is. Poor kid's got a wedgie. Can you imagine trying to do this? Walk a yeah, dog? Right. Walk a dog. Could you imagine walking a dog? <laughs> Wow, this is so oh, funny. I thought she was gonna, I thought she, <laughs> she was in a high speed wobble. She's like, ah! Oh. <laughs> wow, wow, look at that turn ability. I mean, is it really like just for that? Just so you can whip around the corner quick? Combines the world of BMX, skateboarding, it can be used for transportation, exercise, or just fun. Gripped out maple deck, lightweight BMX front wheel, rugged rear skate wheels. I mean, just like, <laughs> just get a normal scooter. Add the cart! Here it is, pretty light. It's just the most awkward thing I've ever seen. One of the great things about a device like this is that you can just straight up walk on it and then just start going. It's just so natural, it's so fluid. Like everything else you gotta like, Send a leg over, get it going. Yeah, you sit down and get crunched in like the other. This thing you just kind of like get on and start going. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Like that, that tail end really. Yeah. It, oh, geez. Stepped okay. on the tire there. I stepped on the wheel. I'm not used to this. So the idea is that you're supposed to be able to like. <laughs> really supposed to be able to like do a turn here. Oh my gosh, this is so awkward. I just I've never seen a scooter ridden like this before. Okay, so this one takes some finesse for real because if you just lean a little bit too much, you're like falling out from under it. It either needs to be tightened or you just need to get really good at it with some finesse. I don't like it's it. It's like watching a clown on a clown bicycle. There's this weird kind of delay to turning. When you start to realize you want to turn, it's already too late. I'm right here. I want to just go around that. I have to like... I can't. It's really weird. <laughs> it's <tough>. <laughs> <laughs> It's kind of cool for going straight, but that's about it. <laughs> Definitely awkward. I'm gonna say no. In my opinion, there's just more fun things to ride. Like those go-karts we rode earlier. Those are about the same price. <laughs> Definitely a no. Next product. <laughs> Whammo! Whammo! Snowball blaster. Snowball blaster. You pretty much can stock it up with snowballs, and then you fire the snowballs at each other, and then boom! Oh my gosh, it's a snowball battle, and... Yeah. <laughs> it's a combination of a yeah. snowball maker and a launcher, brother. I've never seen enough snow to do anything like this, so this is gonna be something that I'm gonna dearly enjoy. Yeah, this would be sick if you were a kid. Like, yeah. if I went to the snow this weekend, I, I would want this. Removable three ball snowball press on top of device. Shoot snowballs up to 80 feet. 80 feet, that's far. That is almost 30 yards. And for like a, a well-packed snowball, that's deadly. 30 yards is pretty far. I mean, I could still easily throw a snowball farther than the only, 30 the yards. The only way you're getting uh, a snowball to 80 feet is if it's well-packed. 
and I don't want to be on the receiving end of That's a, gonna hurt. Yeah, of a snowball that takes 80 feet. All right, let's get a little snowy here. Add to cart. Snowball. Snowball blaster. Wow. So how do it work? Let me show you how do it work. There's a sling inside what? of here. You're gonna put the snowball in said sling, and then you're gonna rip this puppy back. And you're oh. gonna teach everyone a lesson with it. So then you place the snowballs in here. This is to keep them locked and loaded. This is pretty sweet. Okay, well, like what you did right there, though, you tilted it sideways and this went open. So what if all your snowballs I try fall out? I'd pull. You pull with your left? This kid's a rookie. Well, let's go try it. So we got the snowball launcher here. Naturally, it's LA. We don't have a lot of snow. So Ashley has prepared some baking. Baking powder and shaving cream, right? Baking soda, shaving cream. It creates fake snow. And it creates fake snow. So put some in both of these things for me, Tanner. No, come on, you can do better than that, dog. Now, if I just do this quickly. Oh, wow. Ice cream cone. It's like oh. a, oh. <laughs> it's okay. She'll still fly. Ah! <laughs> Did, Did it fly? Hurt? No. What do you mean, ah, then? I mean, it was cold. <laughs> That's not gonna go. That's not good. That's, there's oh. no. <laughs> Dude, you got me in this. Let's see how far it can go. Oh, it literally <laughs> covered me. Half of it just got off, went over and broke on Tanner. I'm gonna smell great by the end of this. Let's see. One, two, three, four, 17, 18, 19, 20. That's 40 feet. That's not 80 feet. I would say maybe you can get to 60 feet if you're like buff and you're like trying to, you know? I would say nope. Just use your arm. I can throw farther than that. All right, guys, we got a morph board. We got a skate slash scoot combo. Dude, I've been seeing these things. Skate slash scoot things. combos. A scoot combo? The skate slash scoot all I, slash When I hear scooter, all I can think of is a dog scooting. It's butt on the carpet. Yeah. Carpet? What carpet? Oh, I didn't have inside pet. Mm. Oh, we did. <laughs> you can kind of do that on this like. Because of that. <laughs> the morph board is the only board you'll ever need. It all starts with one board that transforms in seconds with the super simple LRT lock and release technology. Just drop the extensions into the board and bada bing bada boom, turn. Here's the thing, you know, with any board that's not like a professional grade skateboard, is it just me or are the bearings and wheels just bad? Jank. They are. Bad, yeah. Super jank. Just the quality, it's like that. And it's always like that cheap plastic. Yeah, like if you it's ever like go to Big Five metal. and try to roll a skateboard and it rolls like five feet and stops <laughs> and you're like, wow. I'm gonna buy this one. Yeah. <laughs> this is good. So as you can see right here by these kids, you can pretty much turn it into either a scooter or just a skateboard. Is it really just meant to serve this many purposes though? You know, they have so many combinations though. You're just getting this one. Go to like the shop. I'm sure they have tons more. Oh, like they made the snowboards. Thing. You just get this like foam roller. Wait, oh, what? Wait. That's we dumb We should have done sick. this. All right. If you guys meet 150k likes, we'll buy the battle bots and we'll buy this bouncer. 200k likes and I'll box Matt with both those on my hand. 300k likes and I'll give Tanner a kiss on the forehead. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you don't want to do that. I was like, yo! All right, let's add this baby to cart. All right, guys. So we're here with the morph board. So right now we have it set up as a scooter, but to switch it to just make it into a skateboard, you would take this little blue triangle, you'd push it in, and then you would slide it up, and then it would pop out, and then you would essentially do the same thing on this. Dude, Ooh, look at whoa. how floppy that is. That's made out of plastic. It's definitely not rated for Tanner's weight. It's the mega jump right Tanner, here. Tanner, I think that jump's gonna move and you're gonna hurt yourself. Oh, I can make that. Oh. <laughs> I hit the side. I like moved in to like make sure it, it didn't almost fall. Like... He went over that worse than I would have and I'm a dad. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Did you steer? Did you aim for I can't yeah, steer. He was like not even on it. It keeps trying to me! Are you kidding me? Dude, Come on. Dude. Okay, okay. No now, now I have to try because it can't be that hard. <laughs> hey, you're starting closer. Oh, I'm board slided just like me. <laughs> The hump is the problem. Because it's so bendy, it just dips you right yeah, on top for of the sure. platform. So this is definitely rated for uh, less weight than us. Let's swap out the back piece here. Oh, well that's that's pretty easy. That looks kind of cool. It looks aesthetically pleasing. Yeah, maybe. All right, so overall as a scooter and as a skateboard. Yeah, I think as a kid, I'd like this a lot. So but I is this for as an adult? Oh, as a- Because that's the premise of the video is if we want them as adults. Well, I don't know if this one's actually really for adults. I would say this one's definitely geared towards kids. It's better for kids. For its purpose, I give it a dope. All right, guys, thank you for watching today's video. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to click that video right there. That was my leg, dude. You did that. That right there, guys, is 10 kids products that should have been made for adults. And this video right over here, that is a video that YouTube recommends just for you. Check it out. They're both really funny videos and we'll see you next time. Mm. Peace.